Alright, this is the power up FPV. Right here, I have folded one of the Invader template already and installed the power up FPV module. Now, let's fold another one so you can see how to fold the Invader paper airplane for power up FPV. Actually, power up FPV or power up toys, they have a very clear video on how to fold it, but I just wanted to make my own version. So, let's begin with the Invader model that is supplied. So first thing first, you can see the lines for the Power Up Invader template, Invader model template, all right? So this thing will be actually the top of your airplane, just like this, okay? But for now, this will go back, I mean, on the bottom, all right? Just like this, Invader model on top, right here, name, phone, email. Yes, do write your name, phone, email after you have finished building your aircraft, okay? So that if you lose your aircraft, somebody may find it and email you or contact you about it. All right, so this is it. All right, so let's begin. First off, we will just put it this way. Remember the invader model on top, okay? And start folding. So start folding the first crease from left or right, okay? Try your best to match the lines as much as you can because this one will give you a very nice model. If you don't match the lines, it's not gonna be very nice looking invader model. So take your time, match the lining of your paper. All right, so this is the first fold from the left and you will see a little circle, circle right here, the uh, printed circle, uh, silver one. The printed silver circle right here, you will see it, it should be visible right here. Similarly, go the other side and fold it in. Once again, try to make as precise lining as you can for the sake of a good model. Okay, start folding it. And once again, you will see a circle, a silver circle right here. All right? So this was your first crease, all right? Once again, from the paper, from this side, you put it upside down and fold two creases nice and good. Having that, you have one circle here and one circle here visible, all right? Now, this was your first fold, all right? Next, you will pick this one up from here and put the tip of the page right in the middle of the circle and make a crease, fold it, all right? And same thing goes at the opposite side. Okay, so far everything is looking very nice, all right? This was your second fold, so the tip of the page from here folds to the circle on both sides, all right? And after that, holding the tip right here, you will give it one more fold and match the lines to the edges nice and good. Make sure this does not slip out, okay? Because if this slip out, that's not good. So I will hold it and match the lining right there. Okay, and fold it. That's it. Repeat the same thing to the other side. Alright, now while you are here, if you look at the back side, your fold is actually uh, right to this line, alright? Then on the back, fold it down until you see this line on the back, okay? On the back was a line here, so I would like you to actually exactly fold onto that line and then make the lining nice and good. All right, once you have done it, now comes the taping part. You will fold the right side in, 
making sure you're matching the lining all the way down here. Okay, and fold, 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 fold all the way down there and put the tape on it. Just like this, all right? So one side is done, now we will come and fold the other side in all the way down and put a tape on it as well. Okay, so the tricky part Okay, so the tricky part is actually over. Now we will have to form the wings along this line. So follow this line. So first fold from the center and then start forming this line. Okay, so first I will just go ahead and try to crease it in because it's getting hard on the front and it's getting heavier as well on the front and that's why we have the ailerons to balance our front, uh, heavy front or heavy nose during the flight, okay? So this is it and now I'm going to fold it nicely making sure I stay on this line as much as possible. Okay, this is my first crease off to form the wings and on the second crease or second fold I will just match this to my first fold of the wing. So at the end my wings are a little thicker and <laughs> thinner but hey this is why they have given you eight pieces to master the folding. Alright? Okay, once done now we are shaping up our bird. Alright? Now you have to fold this one up which is the tip of the wing. Okay, let me see the lining and fold it up. Well, I went a little bit more so I'll push it back and similarly I will fold the plane, okay, and try to match the lining here on this one and fold it as well. right there. So now your plane is looking like this when folded. Okay? Alright, now we'll open it a bit like this and uh, straighten out these tips, wing tips. Alright, this is your invader model ready but now you will have to cut in the ailerons. So go ahead and cut the ailerons in. Alright, once the aileron are cut, just make sure to put them up a bit. Alright, this is the adjustment of the ailerons that you will be experimenting and setting up later during the flight, but your invader model is ready to take on your FPV module. So now, all you need to do is, on the bottom right here, Right here, slide the FPV module on your paper aircraft, move it all the way back, match the tails, and slide it a little bit forward so that the back will hold the tail. All right, you can slide it all the way back as well, depends how you want to set your center of gravity. Okay, but that will come with the experimentation. So here it is, your paper FPV virtual reality drawn ready. Power up FPV, ready to fly, ready to give you a virtual reality experience. Thank you for watching the video and thank you very much for your continued support towards my work on YouTube. Please subscribe to my channel and stay updated for all the regular video uploads. If 
you like this video, please hit the like button and share the link over your social sites.